Hello everyone, I'm here today to talk about a kind of institution very important for Jesus. It's about the family. One day his ministry, Jesus said in the book of Matthew, the following words. This world you can see it on the screen, right? He said, For I have come to set a man against his father, a daughter against her mother, a daughter in law against her mother in law. Matthew chapter 10, verse 35. However, these words cannot be understood as a their words or as a problem produced by Jesus. Truly, Several times in the New Testament, when Jesus made a miracle or a wonderful thing for a person, one of the goals of Jesus through the action of his power was to reach the family, to benefit the family. We can see this world of Jesus for an example in the Gospel of Mark, chapter 9, when Jesus made Hebrew uh, a child process of a spirit of demon. In that occasion, Jesus operated a blessing not only for the child, but else for all the family. In another passage in the, in the New Testament, in the Gospel of John, when Jesus gave an experience of salvation to a Samaritan woman, in that occasion, in fact, clearly Jesus wanted to save all her family. The way how Jesus talked to her Show us that. Show us his will to save many families in that place. Moreover, in the same way, in the last moment of his crucifixion, the word of God says that Jesus saw his disciple John and his biological mother Mary and said, Woman, behold your son. And to John, he said, Behold your mother. Praise the Lord. Because the Lord Jesus Christ wants to carry each one of us in every moment. Jesus never forsakes us. Jesus never forsakes us, any one of us. Truly, in fact, our family is very important for Jesus. Jesus wants to save not only me, not only you, but all my family and you, all your family too. Before, make you poor. If your family should don't know Jesus Christ, the one who died for us, he died for all for all for all sins, for all salvations, make your part. Don't let your family remain without knowing Jesus Christ, the one who died for all salvation. Think about that and God bless us. Bye.